So after big incidents like this, where、um, a mother dies after a normal delivery,、um, hospitals and facilities are expected to backtrack and find out where they went wrong. So for our case study, we'll start off with the fishbone diagram, which is taken from our quality and safety in nursing textbook, Figure six point four. And the author says that not all the categories will always be filled out, but in this case, I was able to utilize all six categories. So the first one, people.、Um, of course, the patient is part of this people category, and the labor and delivery nurse and the OB physician.、Um, those are the main key players, and I'm sure there are. Plenty of other staff members, but those are the key players for this、uh, case study. As for regulation, the second category, there was no documentation of quantitative blood loss. Yes, we were given、um, an EBL estimated blood loss of more than two thousand mLs, but we were never given a quantitative, a numerical value for the blood loss. Then management, the third category.、Um, Her first uterine acne was managed with a fundal massage. Then her subsequent uterine acne,、um, the second, third, and fourth ones, were treated with methogen unsuccessfully, which also goes under processes. The fourth category,、uh, the methogen was administered four times, but that was unsuccessful. Also, the DNC was performed three times, also unsuccessful. Then the fifth category, equipment. the The blood transfusion was delayed because they couldn't find proper tubing. And、um, the environment.、Um, as I was reading the case study, I wondered if the patient was、uh, being taken care of in the best environment,、um, given that there were delays in equipment,、um, procuring equipment, and the physician. Left before the patient was completely stable, so it raised a few questions about the environment. And putting all of those things together, we come to the problem statement of the 24-year-old woman, G2P1, 38 weeks gestation. She passed away due to postpartum hemorrhage. So that's the main thing that we're dealing with, and we will. Go into details of what the root cause for that hemorrhage was.